Hello, welcome back to another episode of MTD CNC North America. Today I'm with my buddy Brian. We're at Rego Fix, and we're going to talk a little bit about the partnerships with OEM. So, Brian, let's talk about it. Yep. So here at Rego Fix, uh, our focus with OEMs and the machine tool builders and their dealers is to provide them with support to give the best solution to the customer. So how we do that is we support them through test cuts, turnkeys, R&D, and open houses. And you provide pretty much anything they need through RegoFix for all of those opportunities? Yep. yep, so we work with them. It's pretty much what they need from us to support the customer. So like I said, uh, test cuts, um, test cuts R&D, working on developing processes, the right tooling, um, the right features to, deal, to get through their customers' needs and provide the best solution. Um, R&D, we work with them, we work with tooling companies, we bring tooling companies in to provide best solutions, whether it's cutting uh, aluminum or mild steel or titanium in canal. Uh, we work with those, those partnerships there and just kind of helping to, pro to provide the best solution. First of all, I mean, we have the, the premier work holding or tool holding, I should say, tool holding uh, system on the market. And so we provide great um, technical abilities there with that equipment and that tools. But it's also an aspect that we will work on new products so we can customize our stuff to, to, fit, to best fit the customer's needs. So all, all the premier machine tool builders, they're always doing R&D, trying to find the best solutions, trying to push their machines to get the best options out of it. And we work with them. You know, we work with them with our tooling. We work on uh, maybe if we need to modify our tools a little bit to best uh, fit their machines. And, and also getting feedback and send that feedback to our engineers on, on, next, on next products that we develop and, and release in the future. So, and then when it comes to trade shows, yeah, we work on developing uh, demos, test cuts, looking at the market, looking at our customers, what their, what their issues are in their, in their shops bringing that with the machine tool builders and saying, hey, let's do this demo of this show instead because it'll help, you know, kind of um, connect with the customer. And so with that, we'll, we'll work with them in, in providing tooling and uh, improving out the runoff and then being at the show to support them there and make sure that they look, that they look the best for the customer and can also um, connect to the customer. I like that a lot. And I'll tell you why I like that a lot is because most times people really know their machines. Yep. And then we have an idea about the accessories, right? You know, mm. I work with a lot of the machine dealers. They are fantastic with their machines. They know it very well. But when it comes to, well, what about probing? Okay, yeah. well, what about, you know, what about the tooling that I'm going to, yep. what about the work holding that's going to hold my material? There's, you know, there's an idea, right? Mm -hmm. So for you to say, I will help you at these trade shows show off your machine to its highest capability for the thousands or tens of thousands of people that are going to be walking by that could really benefit them and help mm. them sell future yep, machines yep. as well well and like one thing we talk about is um with our power grip okay you have different sizes you have pg25 pg32 right and some people will think well all right i'm going to use 32 for everything well, when it comes to what material machining and what your process is and whether you're optimized roughing or you're doing more of a traditional machining process, maybe a 32 or a 25, one might, one might perform better than the other because of the size of that holder and the dampening that it provides. So it's kind of that expertise that we'll provide to them where we'll say, okay, you know, um, instead, of, instead of tooling this entire demo up with PG32, for this one operation here, we're better off using PG25, and this is why. I like that. Also. If I'm watching this video right now and I know that, you know, with the millions of viewers around the world and with Rego being as popular as you guys are around the world, having this information has allowed a lot of light bulbs to yeah, go yeah, off, yeah, I yeah, am yeah. absolutely yeah. sure. So, and you already have a bunch of partners, I know this, but if I'm out there right now and I'm watching this video and I'm, you know, an OEM, how do I best go about getting in touch with you or whoever I need to get in touch with to yep. start that par uh, partnership and initiate that conversation? Yep. So, I mean, first of all, if you have a local um, Regal Fix representative that you've worked with, obviously there's a first contact, no problem. Otherwise, you're always able to call our main number and get a hold of somebody. And if it's an OEM issue direct, like say, let's say for a customer or a machine tool builder you have a test cut coming up or you're looking at buying a new machine and you want some regal fix technical support um, you can contact me directly um, my, i mean my, my email is b banister that's b b a n n i s t e r at regal-fix.com easy way to contact me that way um, we're always willing to or call our call our main office and let them know hey you know who's your oem guy uh, i do have a team of oem guys too so 
It depends on where the location is, whether it's in the Midwest or if it's out East Coast or West Coast. Um, I can get my local guy involved and we're there to support. And all you ask for in return is a machine for your showroom, right? Yep. <laughs> that's that's yeah. it. That's all it requires. <laughs> yeah. So when it comes to support, your power grip is an incredible, incredible piece of machinery. Yep. Do you also supply that for trade shows or yeah. for the showrooms of these OEMs as well? Yep. Yeah, we do. So a couple of different processes. I mean, um, we have a machine at trade shows. We'll have a lot of times our power grip machine will be in a machine tool build, builder's uh, booth. And also for at the trade show, it'll obviously be in our booth as well, too. So, for instance, we have a trade show coming up in Dallas, and we've partnered up with a machine tool builder that um, we're doing some test cuts and, and composites, and we'll have this machine in their booth at that show. And we'll be there to, to kind of talk to customers about why our, our machine and our system, the power grip system, worked at, um, exceptional in this composite machining. Uh, so we have that also at, at a machine tool builders at their open houses and their in their tech centers they have our equipment um, so we partner up with them that i mean we have we have a machine across the u.s and a lot of different tech centers and r d facilities and showrooms and it's that way so they can use it it's there for them readily available for their r d and test cut purposes and also for customers and then obviously so they can show what they use and why well, there you go, guys. If you guys are interested in having a partnership with Rego, if you don't already, which you might, uh, get in touch with Brian, get in touch with your local rep, get in touch, touch with your local Rego guy. Um, obviously, there's massive benefits to having Rego in open houses, trade shows, or just the ability for them to do some of the R&D here for you as well. So reach out anytime. Brian, as always, a pleasure to talk with you, my thank friend. You. And thank you for sharing this with the global audience at MTD. Thank you. I appreciate it. Absolutely.